Okay, just wanted to let you guys know I've been, you know, running the reservoir in for a little bit, and uh, it's not completely de-aerated. It's difficult to do that with a recessed fill port because it's below the surface of the rest of the top, but it's pretty much uh, de-aerated at this point. A few little air bubbles to keep uh, showing up, as you can see, but. What I was, I guess, I'm showing is, is that first of all, obviously, no, no leaks, and secondly, um, that the little diverter things are working great because what they're doing is they're keeping the circulation low. They're keeping that low, so you can see that the top is not really disturbed at all, and that's where your noise would be coming from, is if there was a rushing like this. Most people have a fill port at the top, a fill port at the bottom, and what's happening is you're getting this up down circling which is you don't need. All you need is to make sure that you're not starving your, your pump. That's it basically. So keep your ports low, separated, and you get a nice circling along the bottom. Um, the thing that's the noisiest obviously is this little power supply. The pump is nothing special, Alpha Cool uh, 1510. It's a 24 volt pump being run at 12 volts. Got an old uh, storm water block on there, and uh, it's got a lot of restrictions. It's a jet impingement water block, so it slows the flow down in a realistic manner, like a modern loop that would have uh, maybe a couple of radiators and a bunch of blocks in it. Probably be about the same as that one water block. <coughs> so, nice looking, uh, nice looking piece of work. And, uh, the reason I lit it, I guess, was just to show that the bevels pick up the light. It's okay, because that's the only part of the reservoir you're going to see. And even with the face completely sealed off, because I want to protect it until the uh, client gets it. But. Um, you can see the bevels kind of pick up the color of the light that could be back in there. So you could have that light actually above so that you don't see it normally when you're looking down into your case and you would still get light coming out the edges of things. This is kind of interesting, an indirect lighting type thing, very simple to do. Alright guys, uh, this is going to be running for the next, I guess, uh, at least three days. I want to run a good three days. So it's been running a little while. Let it run till uh, probably Saturday morning, is my guess. Let's see if I can get it out the door. Then. All right. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. And I uh, hope you found that reservoir project interesting. There's going to be more coming up on the uh, case and whatnot. But I have to go down and do a different kind of plastic work right now. I'm making wax slug making tools got some fluorescent green and blue plastic arrived a few minutes ago and I need to gnaw on it. See you guys then.